CPAIR is a grant that encouraged research among undergraduates who are members of minority groups and also paired two-year and four-year colleges. My name is Elmer Rayo. I'm from Lewisburg, North Carolina. Um, my name is Gerardo Jaramillo. I'm from Fayetteville, North Carolina. My name is Rosalani Robinson, and I go to Lewisburg College in North Carolina. My name is Agosa Segla, and I live in New York City. My name is Edwin Olaya, and currently I'm a student at New York City College of Technology. This combination of faculty and student, along with a mentor at the institution where you work, it's perfect. The student has more help from both the mentor at that particular hosting institution and the faculty. And um, the faculty gets up to date with what's going on. This has been the dream of my life to be able to work at NASA with NASA scientists doing things that are actually useful. I can sort of relate to my, my internship students from the CPER program because we came from small universities and they had really good curriculums in terms of basic science and engineering and math. Uh, but it was never instilled in us until NASA became involved in our curriculum development that you can do things that go beyond basic uh, research and manufacturing that you can study to become a scientist or an astrophysicist. Experiences that a student can obtain here are very similar to what they can expect to see at other research institutions across the government and academia as well. Uh, it's also very similar to an industrial environment in some ways. They've never seen a flight instrument before. They've never seen, they only saw stuff in books and in, on TV. They never got to touch a blanket, or they never got to touch uh, uh, any of these uh, technologies used in NASA before. We are working on, the, on one of the biggest pro projects that NASA has at the moment, the James Webb Space Telescope. And um, for me, that's, that's a really, really great opportunity. I learned how to work together in order to achieve a goal. And always, you have to get help from each other. People that work here are once interns just like me. Working with my mentor, Dr. Roman, he's, he's very funny, he's very spirited, you know, it's easy to talk to him, he's, he's a good teacher. We're looking at Landsat data uh, for an entire data record of 25 years. We've been working on grasslands from southern Iowa and northern Missouri, and what we're looking at is for restoration in prairies. And what we found in Decatur Change was that it actually has been restored. I see personal growth in every student that has come here. You get to meet a lot of different people and a lot of people that are very open, have good energy, and that's what everybody wants in a workplace. A key part about uh, what we do here is that we, we look at our students as, as our next generation. I'd like to help students. It's good to get the work experience and not only just sit in a classroom but, but actually get their hands dirty and see how, how, how a lot of theories apply in real life. Thinking, uh, you know, what can I do to repay some of the mentors who took time out of their busy schedules when I was an undergraduate and a graduate student to spend time with me, to put me on the right path and to, to help me out. And uh, someone said to me, um, you can't really do anything to pay those people back. But the thing that you can do is pay it forward in a certain way. I want to thank them for accepting us, even though they are so busy, you know. Uh, they found time for us. Before taking the class, the remote sensing class in New York City, I never realized that I, I can I got the opportunity of working at NASA. For me, working here is the, the best thing. That, it's like a dream, though. No?